Hey guys, welcome back to Mr. Santos Science Lab. So today we're gonna talk about light, light energy, okay? So what is light? So light is actually an energy that can travel in any medium, okay? It can travel through space, it can th travel through air, through water, okay? It can travel in anything. So <clears throat> uh, light travels in what direction? How do you think light travels? Go ahead and pause the video. Think about it. Okay, so light actually travels in a straight line, okay? How do we know that? I'm gonna do a little quick demonstration to show you that light travels in a straight line. <clears throat> okay, I have a laser right here, okay? When you use a laser, you always have to be careful not to, po not to point at yours or anybody's eyes. <clears throat> okay, so a laser actually, okay, travels it, it actually sends a, a light ray in one direction. When you have your flashlight, it sends it in multiple directions. That's why you can see more light. But a, a laser actually sends it in one direction. And we're going to see if, if we can create a single light ray traveling in a straight line. Okay. So let's go ahead and w let's do the experiment. Okay. For this experiment, all you need is baby powder, <clears throat> a container, so you do not make a mess, and of course you need your laser, okay? So, <clears throat> why can we not, we cannot see the light traveling from the laser to this dot over here? The reason we cannot see it traveling is because it's not hitting anything. It's actually traveling through air. It's hitting the air molecules which are invisible. So, we need to hit something, <clears throat> it needs to hit something. So when he hits the powder, the baby powder is actually re, it's actually bouncing the light back to your eyes, and that's why you're able to see it. So I'm gonna go ahead and pour some baby powder or spray, uh, release some baby powder on top of the light. <clears throat> that way we can see the light beam. Okay, here we go. Okay, as you can see. Now it looks like I have an actual laser beam. Uh, like I have a Star Wars, what's it called? Okay. All right, so now we can notice that the light's traveling in a straight line. And of course, the more you make the powder come up, the more you see the laser light, okay? And the light is traveling in a single straight line direction which is pretty cool, okay? Okay, now we know that light travels in a straight line, okay? <clears throat> the laser sends out a light ray in a straight line. Now, what happens when it hits something, okay? So we noticed that the light was hitting the particles in the, uh, the baby powder particles, okay? The baby par powder par particles are white so when the light hits those particles it bounces the light back to your eyes that way you're that that's why you're able to see okay the light beam okay or the light ray okay <clears throat> if we did not uh throw some powder on there we would not be able to see it okay so the light has to bounce back to your eyes to be able to see it okay so one thing that bounces back the uh, your your eyesight pretty good your, the light is actually a mirror, okay? Notice that the mirror reflects everything that I do. I can look at the mirror and I can see myself, okay? You can see that you're looking at yourself right now, okay? So the mirror, when you look at a mirror, it bounces the light from your eyes back to you. So you're able to see yourself, okay? Now, when I shine a light at it, same thing. Notice that I'm shining it at the mirror, but it's bouncing to my face. So the light's actually hitting the mirror and coming back at me, okay? Now, when you do the laser, same thing. The light <clears throat> goes to the mirror, and I'm gonna try to see if I can get you can see the light, right? 
I'm trying to get the light to hit <clears throat> you guys, but it's okay. All right, so you notice that once the laser hits the mirror, it bounces back. Okay, so let me go ahead and give you a little quick demo about that. All right, so I don't know if you noticed back there, but I'm gonna shine the laser right there. I have one, and then I have another one over here. I have two targets, okay, right about there, okay? Two little targets. <clears throat> my goal is to try to hit the targets with my laser using a mirror. So I'm gonna shine the light at the mirror. So it's gonna go at this direction. When I shine the light to the mirror, it should bounce back. Let's see if that's true, okay? All right, so I'm shining it at the mirror and notice that I am getting a shine. There we go, I got the first one. Let's see if I can get the second one. And there we have it, okay? I'm shining the light directly to the mirror. <clears throat> when I shine the light at the mirror, it bounces back to my target on my uh, right and then my target on my left, okay? So this mirror bounces the light back. We call that reflection. When the light bounces back to you or to another, uh, to somewhere else, it's called reflection, okay? What I want you to think about is, <clears throat> what are some other items that reflect light? So go ahead and think about it. What are some other items that reflect the light, make the light bounce back to you, okay? Go ahead and think about it. And if you're virtually, go ahead and leave those comments. What are some items that reflect the light back at your eyes so you can see it, okay? Go ahead and pause the video. All right, guys, so this time I'm gonna use two mirrors, okay? Mirror one and mirror two, and I'm gonna try to hit this artificial target that I made, and I'm gonna put it on the floor, so it's gonna be a little bit harder. So my goal is for my laser to hit mirror one, bounce to mirror two, and then hit my target here, okay? <clears throat> if I can do that, then I understand that light reflects, light bounces off shiny objects, okay? When I do this, hopefully I can do this, I'm going to go ahead and add some powder so that we can see the light traveling in that direction. Are you guys ready? All right, so let's, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna give myself about 30 seconds. Hopefully I can set this up. So my goal here is to make it bounce from one mirror to another, okay? So I'm gonna sh shine it here, and then I know that it bounces this way, okay? And then I'm once it shines to this mirror, I want it to bounce to this other mirror over here. Let's see if I can do that. And once it bounces off the second mirror, notice that the light bounces back down here. So I'm gonna have to adjust my mirror a little bit to make it hit my target. And there you have it, guys. I was able to do it within 30 seconds. Hopefully that was 30 seconds. If not, you guys can tell me. Mr. Santos, you took more than 30 seconds. All right, so now I'm gonna do the same thing, but I'm gonna add some baby powder so we can see the lines traveling. And let's see if we can make it work again. And there you have it. So I'm gonna go ahead and add some powder so that we can see the lines traveling. Okay, can you guys see that? Hopefully you can. I know I gotta clean this mess up, I will, I promise. Okay, but notice that the light is actually bouncing, 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 and it hits my target perfectly. Well, there you have it, guys. Today was an amazing day, talking about light and how the light reflects and how the light travels in a straight line until it hits an object, okay? In this case, we were talking about a mirror, okay? Um, thank you guys so much for always following me. Thank you guys for always watching the videos. Um, it really does help out a lot, help out a lot um, to be able to know what I'm doing right, what I'm doing wrong. Um, please leave a comment and I will get back to you guys. So here it is. Thank you guys for watching. Have a great day.